वेलकम टू स्प्रिन बेस्ट ट्यूटोरियल सीरीज बाई जावा कोडिंग स्किल्स इन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी टॉक्ड अबाउट आइटम रीडर लिसनर सो हियर वी विल फोकस ऑन प्रोसेसर लिसनर द प्रोसेसर लिसनर इज ऑल्सो प्रिटी मच सिमिलर विथ रीडर लिसनर दैट मोटो मोटो इज सेम बट दिस इज स्लाइट डिफरेंस दैन रीडर एंड प्रोसेसर लिसनर इन रीडर पार्ट वी विल ट्रैक टू द रिकॉर्ड before reading and after reading and anything went wrong while reading right so but the processor uh, we will more talk about processing part so once uh, reader will read something and giving those data as a input to the processor so processor doing some operation on that input so while processing that record if something went wrong so if something not went wrong if something go to smooth so we have some state like before processing after processing and if anything went wrong we have on error process so those thing we will see here in programmatically how it will work so let us jump into the code part so if you remember uh, we have the same uh, same old example where we are reading one file and inserting into the database we will leverage the same in previous video we attach some reader listener so here we will add one more listener that is process listener so let me add one listener for processor here process listener you can name anything so similarly here also one interface like item process listener and we'll take type of input so here our input is employee dto and output is employee so how exactly uh, this is work if you uh, remember in our previous video where we started learning this configuring this uh, processor part here input is employee dto that is coming from a reader part once the data getting you know read by the reader it converted to this employee dto based on this mapper if you open this mapper they converted this data into employee dto so later this data being used as input to the processor and in processor we are reading uh, let me open this processor first so in this processor that dto which we are already read from the file is coming here for processing purpose in form of this employee dto once we perform some operation we might convert into another dto as well if we not converting we can say use the same thing here as well but in our case to just give that feeling we are doing some process and conversion we converting into this employee uh, object so that's what the second parameter is employee this is t and this is s yes for uh, in this uh, interface this is t this is s yes. so this is target this is source something like that so if you uh, remember our reader listener uh, there we have before read and the method signature is empty this method uh, parameter is empty right but in this uh, we are expecting this t t means the input the input type in our case is employee dto so in before process we have some information about this t that is employee dto data and once we done with process we have two information thus the first is this input which we are going to read in the before process and after reading we perform some operation out of it so we converting into the s yes. so this is second parameter and this processor part is remains same uh, this exception be anyways we have in reader we have only have i think exception let us confirm that and reader listener we have only exception because there no such input information available here right while well, reading itself it may fail so we don't have any information so this first parameter is empty here but in processor case we have at least input that is coming from the reader part so that's what we first parameter the same input here the type of t this is first, first parameter this first type and second one is exception if while processing something went wrong we might end up with any error or exception we can handle that here so let us add some you know uh, sop here as well so i'm adding before process before process i'm just printing this employee dto in after process also 
Let us side one more SOP, the same like that after process. You can do more, more and more thing here. Suppose you want to add some validation. Uh, employee DTO will print employee DTO here because already employed uh, this employee DTO already we have uh, printed here. So let us print employee only here. So both we can print here and on error, right? So let us print that error, which error we are going to get on error. Okay, so we'll print that error. He dot get message. So pretty much similar with that reader listener itself. So here we done with this uh, configuration, right? So we will add uh, some logic which will cause some error while processing, right? So let us add that. Here we are processing, right? So here we are calculating age, right? So do one thing. Let me add one logic, such logic. If a is employee dot get a is double equal to or equal to. Let me check input data for that. Not this. Suppose is equal to 56. Okay. So if a is equal to 56. If is equal to 56, throw some exception. Throw new arithmetic exception. Give some some error. Some error. Or write some 56 not allowed here. Something. We, we can basically uh, do any validation here. So any valid, validation kind of logic if you have in your uh, spin batch uh, use case, right? So you can add here. Suppose you are reading something uh, while processing something you don't want to allow. In that case, throw some exception. That's it. So those record automatically will skip. It will not go into the writer part. So here we added some validation as well. So we have a good record that will anyways will process. This bad record will not go into process due to this exception. So we will check that. So I think we have done. We have this same uh, file record which we used in reader listener. So this will process. This will get in while reading error. This one, this one also. So the last one will uh, throw also exception. Only two record will insert into the DB. So let me truncate the DB first. So end of this execution, we should have to record in the database. Let me restart that. Okay, we forgot one more thing. We just uh, created this listener, right? So we have to register this as well, similar to this uh, reader listener, right? So let us add this in same fashion. Process listener, process listener, name could be anything. So let us register this listener as well. We can add a many listener. So we have done with this registration as well. So it's the listener getting attached to this particular step. So while it's getting this step, this listener will work. So let us restart this server once. Let us add a deeper point as well. Is it ready? Okay, so it's coming uh, before it. Uh, let me remove from this uh, reader part. We already tested this, so we focus on this processor listener. So this is coming here, right? So let us check what kind of data it's bringing here. First record, it's fine. So let us check the second thing here also. First record, 
and that converted uh, thing, nothing great, right? So, yeah, now that uh, this time it will get error in the case of I think last record. Let me check that what information they yeah, are 56, right? The age is 56, so it's uh, throwing exception, so it's coming here. So let us check what kind of exception it's there. Get that 56 not allowed, right? So, so uh, it's uh, doing well, right? Whatever the exception it's supposed to throw, it's throwing, so it's coming here. So that's what you can know. I do some validation and track uh, what all the record getting failed while processing. Rather here, uh, print, uh, printing here, you can add into the some global education context uh, variable and later you can print those anywhere or persist in the DB. Same like a reader. So let me finish that education part. Now job is completed successfully. Let us confirm in the DB ones. Two record getting inserted, right? It's supposed to insert two, so it's inserting two. So we are good. So, yeah. so the code base is same. Uh, I will end up this, you know, uh, all the listener. Uh, I will upload this into the GitHub. Already link given in the description. You can clone that and you can add uh, some more logic from your end. In this video, we will check on the writer listener in the same way. This area and processor we have done. Uh, writer is also the same but we will check that as well and thanks for watching the video please do like and subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to not miss any future notifications <laughs>